All right, everybody, how y'all doing today? And welcome back to my channel. It's that time. It is time to build my brother's PC. Yes, as y'all see all the parts in front of me. Now, keep in mind, before I go ahead and get started with it, I will often use the um, Antec Media Center um, motherboard, the Asus um, motherboard that I wanted to use, but he said he wanted Windows 10. The Asus uh, M268N VM is on Windows 7. 32-bit and 64-bit Windows Vista, as well as Windows XP, both 32-bit and 64-bit. And since he said he wanted Windows 10, I had to say, okay, bro, I gotta go do some shopping for you. Now, keep in mind, my brother don't do no content creator work. He do not do any video gaming. He just wants his system just to play his Spotify, listen to his music, which I got to put back into the system anyway, and watch a little Netflix and Hulu 1080p style. I told my brother, you know everything 4K, he said he don't care about that 4K stuff. He don't care about the 4K TVs. He don't care about the 4K um, gaming monitors. He just want his computer where he can do his basic internet browsing and playing his music with Windows Media Player or Groove or Apple and Watch this Hulu and Netflix in 1080p. All right, let's go over the parts right now. The CPU is the AMD A10 5800K CPU, which is an AP because it do have the Radon R7 graphic control on the inside of it. It is four cores, four threads, 100 watt TDP, and this would be good for him now. The motherboard that I'm going to go over came with a CPU, which is the A6 5400K, which is two cores, two threads. I want to have a little more performance and a little more push when doing this little multi-thread. I'm going to do this multitasking. So other than that, the A10 5800K, four cores, four thread uh, APU will be good enough for him. All right, and the CPU cooler is the Zelman. CNPS 8X Optima. This is a great cooler. I use it on one of my PCs. And to go ahead and keep this baby cool when it's at thermal, which is about 41 degrees Celsius. And if you do a little bit multi test, it's gonna go up to like 56 to 60 degrees Celsius. So this is a CPU cooler by Zelman. Works great for his needs. Now the motherboard of choice is the ASRock FM2A78M HD Plus. Um, operating system support for this motherboard is Windows 7, Windows 8, Windows 8.1 Pro, and Windows 10 64 bit as well as 32 bit. So, this here works good for him, and he got no issue with this motherboard. The memory is the G Skill. Do a kit 16 gigabyte non ECC DDR3 at 1600 RPM. It's gonna go ahead and fly good speeds for him. That's all he needs just for his basic multitasking task with his Hulu, Netflix, um, headquarters music, um, Spotify, etc. These server work for him into that speed. Now, the storage, which I'm going heavy on. Because I got to pack all that information that he needs back into his computer. The storage is the ADATA SU630 480GB SSD. Perfect for his um for his needs. The um write speed of it is 520 megabit per second as well as the read speed is 450 megabit per second. Now keep in mind uh, to the gamers universe. The higher the numbers on the read speed and write speed, the better the, the better the performance of the SSD. So for him, this will work great for him and it's not an issue. Now, coming in on the excess mechanical storage are the Hitachi 2 500 gigabyte hard drives SATA, SATA 2 at 7200 RPM 
It's gonna hold everything I gotta pack into it from the movies, from the music, and if you wanna put his pictures up there with him and his fiance, then he got accessible storage for that. Alrighty, now the GPU. Now back in the game, back in the days, this GPU was good for gaming. Now this GPU is just good just for powering up your monitors. This is the Sapphire Radon HD 7770 1GB Vapor X GPU. Dual fans can't go wrong with it. 1GB is good enough for him. He could go ahead and watch his HD movies on it. And as well, it has your two DVIs, your HDMI, as well as your disc port. Uh, 1.4 disc port um, adapter. So you cannot go wrong with that. Now the case, as you see right in front of me, is the Cougar MX330G. Great case. I did a build with it. I decided I'm not going to go on that route with it no more. So, and I'm giving it for him, to him. It is great airflow. You cannot go wrong with it. You got very, you got the mesh front. You got the mesh front top, and you got a nice uh, 120 millimeter fan for support in the back of the case. Now, if you want to go radiator with this case, it supports up to 240 up front, 120 millimeter up top, as well as 120 millimeter in the back. So you cannot go wrong with that. Now the power supply did come from the Antec Media Center. This is the Cosair TX650 TX650M PSU. It is 80 plus bronze. Cosair still selling. You can get Lisa off their website for $129. But a good find. It is clean, it is very quiet, and it's cool. It is semi modular, so if you need more module hookups, you have to go ahead and purchase the cable from um, Cosier, and you cannot go wrong with that. And last but not least, are the Cool Moon CMY R5. You get a five pack, it's an RGB fan, you get the controller with it as well. The controller hooks up, up to 10 fans, and you cannot go wrong with it. It is up to 1300 RPM, so when it comes down to cooling, you know, y'all, everybody know I'm the beast at air cooling. So anything from 1300 all the way up to 2500 RPM, yes, some of them go up to 3000 RPM. Now, y'all keep in mind the louder. The RPM, the noisier the fans are, so a lot of these gamers don't connect, crank the fans up that loud. I'm used to it because back in the old school day from 1990 era all the way to the early 2000s, we had loud fans. But one thing I like about it that all our tech has improved for better performance and great use. So you don't hear all that noise coming from it. Now these fans are very quiet, and that's one thing I love about Cool Moon. And I will be buying a lot of their products in the near future. And enough talking. Let's put this baby together. I'm talking 6 a.m. tea times. 18 with the mayor talking land banks. I waited for it, gotta get mine Snack a seat up at the table if my man can't Head into a meeting, we're familiar with no briefcase Just my mind in a free state I got a plan through a vision, but it takes time I'ma make mine Summertime and then why? Know the deal, know what's up Too much for the books, then I put it in a tuck Too much for the tuck, then I give it to my love Once I make a million, man, a mill won't be enough Watch me fake the struggle while I get it off the hush Now it's jet blue miles, Rolex dials Frowns turn to smiles, summertime and then why?
want you to bring that energy summertime to the summertime. And run that thing back. Yeah. Until next year. Summertime and then why? Yeah. Yeah. Summertime and then why? Yeah. Summertime and then why? For the meaning, hate the way we treat this. Why you in a rush? No, you got no business leaving. Why you always leaving? No, you want that repeat. Yeah, he ain't no way around it. We got a thing about us. You got your way about you. Now, much to say about it. Still have your way around me. They say it was something special. Is it better when we left it? All this inside of my head. Knowing you're ready. I just wanna know because it takes some time to do that though. You know, it's not that many cables to route, but you know, I like to go on there and, and pay attention to my tie down points. So I go ahead and tie down these uh, cables properly. Um, she's a beast, she's nice. And she came out right. And my brother, she gonna, my brother is going to love it. I know he is. Um, can't go wrong with it. 
Just like I said, you got great airflow. You got the nice, good mesh panel up front. You know, you got nice, good mesh panel up front. You got the um, air panels up top. You know, this, I love these air panels here. You know, these have magnetic panels. Some, some, some content creators don't like using these here, but the less dust that gets into your system, the better. Um, so it do get a lot of great airflow coming in. So it's not like you're not getting no airflow. Um, she's nice. Now, like I said, my brother is not a gamer. He just needed for a basic use, which is browse the internet, listen to his music, find music for him to download, and he could go head on on and then chill with his wife on the patio, listen to all the good music they got while they socialize and do their thing. So right now, she's a beauty. I'm gonna go ahead on and do the cable management. Install Windows 10. I'm not gonna go through the, the video y'all see me install Windows 10. Y'all know how to do it. If you don't know how to install Windows 10, there are multiple videos on YouTube to help y'all download the um, ISO on a USB flash drive and then connect it to your computer by booting off from the flash drive. There's tons of videos up there. I'll be adding that in the link in the description below. And also, I will be putting all of the information you need about everything I use in the description below. So y'all can go ahead and click on that their website and you know, and look up the um, parts that I use for this build here. Um, just like I said, gamers, this is not for gaming though. Know, Cause now to play your anime games, you need a harder CPU and a harder GPU. For my brother, this is basic, and this is one reason why I, I love doing builds like this. Uh, so I can go ahead and let the basic builders that, you know, I ain't forgot about you, but right now, Intel and AMD go into a different direction where they're just focusing on gaming and better for 4K presentational needs. So, but for basic builders like me and everybody else, we still, we still around, so. And I love to use this uh, APU by AMD, the A10 5800K, the um, the Sapphire Radon HD7770 GPU. This is one gigabyte. One gigabyte is good for powering up your monitors and just browsing the internet and doing basic HD needs. Alrighty, now when I'm done doing everything, I'm going to go ahead on and um do my love um photo montage as well as the product presentation montage video so here we go